still. Uh, a lot of the impetus, a lot of the demand uh, that you're seeing in the US economy is coming because of government spending. And, and that, uh, how do you really get hold of that? So if you really move quickly in terms of cutting rates or doing QE and government spending, and that money is still circulating, you very, very quickly ignite inflation. And I think uh, that is why they may not be able to move as fast as we would like to think or as they have done in the past. They might actually have to wait for things to slow down in terms of economic activity before they can, you know, uh, move quickly to cut rates or go back to QE. And so I think that's the time. Yeah. Uh, no, got that. Uh, Rohit, uh, you know, it's a pleasure speaking with you. Great explanation. Appreciate you joining in here uh, for that. The market, by the way, is that we end down 100 points and, uh, you know, three uh, big time off the highs of the day. The correction starting at about 1.30 p.m. But uh, here's a special interaction. My colleague from CNBC, Avaz Lakshman Roy, is sitting down with a finance minister. Uh, so let's just cut across. Out silicon. Thank you for watching CNBC TV 18. For all our top stories and news updates, follow us on our social media platforms.